Laren's chest located in level 50 wilderness is a reward you can claim by obtaining Laren's keys from wilderness slayer. The Laren's chest contains great rewards with the best items being the Dagon high robes. And every time someone opens a chest here, everyone close by gets a ping notification that someone have opened the chest. So this week I will be spending my time here at the Laren's chest and kill anyone who opens this chest. Oh, someone's here. How is he alive from that ADS? There we go. Our first kill here! Beautiful! He opened one key and he got pure essence. What a disappointing first kill. Who is this? Smite it? Let's switch with my main. Double ADS. 40 KO, 73 KO, beautiful. I think he had a lot of loot. 25 Laren's keys, oh my god. Oh my, he was opening up all those keys. The thing, two mil in the bag. Yeah, give me a few hours here and I'm gonna make so much money. I think I'm gonna keep all the keys for the end of the video and make a huge key opening. He's opening a lot of them. He's opening a lot, oh my god. Good fight, Gurk. Good fight. 700k? Okay. No keys, unfortunately. Even though I'm scouting and hopping on four different accounts at the same time, I still go on dry streaks. It's now been four hours without finding a single person. Oh, 5 to 5. He might have logged out. <gasps> he had nothing. Good fight, sir. 500k from three keys. Wait, is that the lawnmower 4.0 from Manscaped? And coincidentally, Manscaped just happens to be today's video sponsor. As you all know, Manscaped have been a part of this channel for a very long time now. They are mostly known for their performance package 4.0, which includes their premium lawnmower 4.0 body hair trimmer and crop preserver ball deodorant. However, I am happy to present their brand new safety razor Plow 2.0, a razor for super close shave for your face, neck and beard. If you're a fan of a single blade close shave solution with a maximum performance, this is the one for you. It is very easy to use, simply let the blade glide smoothly over the curves of your face using one long stroke at a time. And if you decide to get anything from Manscaped, be sure to check out the Shed Travel Bag for easy and convenient travel. Go to manscaped.com engineer to get 20% discount plus free international shipping plus two free gifts. The discount is automatically applied at checkout. Here we go. How are you still alive? Dead, thank you. He just showed up here. Six Laren's keys, beautiful. I'll take those six. And some loot. And the loot from the three keys he opened was worth 660k. Dead. Oh my god, we got him. Unless... Yep, yeah, he dead. From the Jima. Oh my god, seven Lance keys! Oh my god, hello! He was a PK as well. He was geared up for PK. Thank you, seven Lance keys! Beautiful. Let's have a look here. Check deposit. 1.7 mil from that PK. That's, I think that's the second biggest PK I've gotten so far. As of right now, we are 30 hours into scouting and hunting here at the Laren's chest. And I must point out, there is a surprising amount of people with only one or two keys opening here. I don't really show the kills on them because it's really underwhelming kills. He says no man. Die, please, he says. Is he gonna run? He's dead. Yep, he's dead. I brought my second account here and he's dead. And I got the loot on my main account, six Larian's keys. Oh my god, that's a huge. Uh, and some loot as well. Have a look here. 450k in the bag, 364, level 65, 1.6 mil grads. <laughs> that you opened like seven of those. 
Oh my fuck, 27 Larence keys! Holy shit, from my level 65! Are you kidding me? Look at all the loot! One, almost two mil in the looting bag as well. Oh my, we're banking this. We're going to the bank. Is this the biggest PK so far? I think it is. You know what my dream is with this video? Is that someone gets a Dagon IP and then I kill them for it. I just want to see their reactions. Yeah. This clip I'm about to show you is probably the most upsetting escape in this video. This guy had been opening non-stop chests. I don't know how many he opened. And he had a friend boxing him back to the bank. Which means he probably opened a lot. But neither of them brought any food and I managed to kill his friend. But the guy opening all the chests got a log out and got a gap. Oh, my pure killed him. I didn't even need my main. 650k, I'll take that. Level 81. 50. And he's dead, yeah. Beautiful. 1.7 mil. Oh, oh, we had some loot from previously. If there's something I really like doing, then it's gotta be a clean switch between two of my accounts to kill a player. I'm gonna go down on my main. And he's dead. I didn't need to go down on my main. I think I opened like, uh, how many was that? Like seven, eight keys? 500k. He's dead. That was a quick quill. He calls me a noob. And we get six Laren's keys, beautiful. We got one mil in the bag, it's nice. I previously thought this was common knowledge, but apparently it's not, because no one has used it so far. There's a ladder here, just north of the chest. If you go up here, there's a one times one tile where no one can attack you, unless you go here and like bolt them, bam bam. But you see, you can't melee them, but you can still bolt them. But if you use this tile in combination with this ladder right here, like you can very easily get a log out very quickly. And for some reason, no one has so far used this ladder. A lot of openings in 465, that's three. Is that only three? <gasps> oh my God, he could have gotten the log. Come on, he says. 384K. It was a level 53, so good thing I came on this account and not the main. 155K. As of right now, it's been eight hours of scouting and I haven't seen a single person. Just open one. PK in here. Picture. Here's the picture, brother. That's a tome. He was holding a tome of fire for 1.2 mil. I'll take the tome. Thank you. The last two days have actually been pretty depressing here at the Larian's chest. Uh, found one PK, my first PK I've seen so far. But besides that, I've only gotten small kills. Kills not really worth showing, but I'm showing them right now. But you know what they say, I am here as a creator, so you don't have to be here. Finally we found someone, and we're probably gonna get this kill as well. Yeah, this is the kill. There we go, beautiful kill. Please, he had a Dins Bulwark, gotta be keys. He had no keys! 400k. Good fight, capable, good fight. 358k. Here we go. He's gotta have something, he's a high level. I can't hit with the bolt. I haven't completed it. Dead? He's dead. Oh, I hadn't completed the thing. Four Lance keys, beautiful. Okay, I gotta run around. That's very lucky I got him on that last hit. I would have been so upset if he got away there. One mil in the bag, beautiful. And it's finally time for what you all have been waiting for. We made a total of 12.5 mil from PK players, and we also got 87 Larence keys. If there is something I've learned from peeking at the Larence chest for two weeks, then it's gotta be that you don't bring your entire Larence key stack when you open the chests. And for that reason, I'm bringing the entire stack. Let's go. Let's open them. We're looking for one Dagon eyepiece, that's all we want. Yes, there it is, our first Dagonai piece, the Dagonai rope top, which is the most expensive one. I like that. Oh my god, there is another one too. Two Dagonai tops. Alright, the most expensive one, as I said. Beautiful, I do like that. Alright, 
15 keys left. Can we get another piece? The hat, maybe. Maybe the bottoms. Uh, last two keys here. Gold doors and diamonds. Very happy. We got two pieces. In the bag, we have 11 mil plus our two Dagonite tops. Put them in as well. From 8 to 7 chests, we made 20.6 million. The final price check of this video, how much did we actually make? 33 mil. Not too bad. So this week I saw the Northern Lights for the first time in my life, so it's something special. Normally you have to travel all the way to the northern parts of Sweden to see it, but I was lucky enough to see it in my city and take this picture. So yeah, this part had nothing to do with the video. I just wanted to inject you guys with something going on in my life. And this was the highlight. Also, it's been a while since we got 10,000 likes. I don't know if it's possible to ever reach that point in my YouTube career again. But if you want to help me reach 10k likes, feel free to give the video a like.